guys, today for our leveled read aloud, we're reading Cat. This is by Rob Arego and it's illustrated by Jackie Snyder. Her strategy focus for this book is what will Kat's friends bring her for a surprise party? As you read, stop now and then to summarize. So you can pause this video and stop whenever you feel like you are ready to summarize something. And remember, summarize means to tell what's already happened in just like one to two sentences. So not rereading, but just telling somebody what's happened so far in the story. Let's go ahead and get started. It was Kat's birthday. Her friends didn't know what to do. I know, said Pig, let's have a surprise party. That's a good idea, they said, but what food shall we have at the party? The friends talked and talked, but they couldn't agree. Talking about food made them very hungry, so the friends decided that they would each go to the market. Dog ran to the market. He walked up and down the roads. The rows. All the shopping is making me hungry, he said, so he bought some dog bones and went back to Cat's house. Pig hurried to the market as fast as his little legs could carry him. All this walking is making me hungry, he said. So Pig bought his favorite vegetables and put them in the cart. Hen carried her basket as she walked through the market. Carrying this basket is making me very hungry, she said. So she bought some cornmeal. Rat scampered off to the market. She had eaten a very small breakfast, even for a tiny rat. All this food is making me hungry, she said, so she decided to buy some cheese. Horse trotted up and down the hills to get to the market. Trotting has made me very hungry, he said, so Horse bought some oats. Cow walked the long way to the market. Walking so far has made me hungry, she said, so she decided to buy a bag of hay. Stop right now and summarize what has happened. Pause the video and summarize to someone what's happened. Tell what's already happened. After they finished shopping, the excited friends rushed back to Cat's house. They put the food on the kitchen table. Then they hid and waited for Cat to come home. When Cat came home, her friends jumped up and shouted, Happy birthday, Cat! Cat was happy to see her good friends. I'm so surprised, she said. Come to the kitchen table, Cat, they said. All the waiting had made them very, very hungry. The friends looked at the food. Then they looked at Cat. We forgot to get food for Cat, they cried. But you didn't forget the most important thing, said Cat. What's that, they asked, to be good friends. Then Cat got a bowl of milk and everyone sat down to eat. Being good friends had really made them hungry. All right, guys, I'm going to put the response questions in the description box below so that you can either think about them, talk about them with someone, or write them down in a notebook to make sure that you are still understanding the story and making those connections and comprehending. All right, guys, I will see you in my next video.